to demonstrate how to make a scatter chart and how to add the equation as well as the all square values on the chart and how to add more decimal places uh, in the Excel equation. All right, so um, let's just start it. So at the very beginning, you need to get the uh, x value and y values correspondingly type on the A column and the B column. And then you need to highlight the values you want to plot. And then after that, you click the insert tag and then select the scatter chart image and then just select one you want and uh, in a typical task then you will need to have the labels on the x-axis and the y-axis so that would be the exit titles which is the primary one on the x-axis and add chart element axis title primary vertical on the y-axis so you can edit the quantities and also the units right here for the trend line just the same add chart element, trend line, and then linear. For those who need to have like squares equations, they probably need to select a more trend line option. And later on, we'll talk about it in the next video. So you need to click the uh, linear, and then the uh, trend line or the lead square line will pop up. And by double clicking the trend line, there will be a menu popping up. And then you can select right here to display the chart, the equation on the chart and to display the R squared values on the chart. So it would automatically calculate it for you. And if you think that like four decimal places is not enough for accurate calculations, you can simply double click this box. And then by selecting the label options right here, there will be a bar chart label called the uh, label options. And then you can select the category to be number and then you can change the decimal places right here. So let's say it's change it to 20. So you will have enough decimal places for an accurate calculations. So I hope it helps and uh, like this video if you like uh, this useful tricks. And remember to also subscribe our YouTube channel if you want to find more tricks on doing the Excel efficiently. Thanks for watching.